Right, look in your pocket, purse, bag, or junk drawer, and chances are you'll find a key fob. The basic ones lock and unlock your cars, doors, and the fanciest fobs do much more. But no matter which kind you have, replacing it costs a lot more than cutting an old-fashioned set of keys used to. Trooper Steve shows us a few simple tips from Consumer Reports to save money if you need a new fob. Depending on your age or the age of your car, you might not even remember life before a key fob. After all, these now common fobs offer many conveniences. But maybe you've experienced the downside. The cost to replace the latest key fobs can be as much as $400 or more, depending on the brand. Then add another $20 to $130 to program the thing to work with your car. It could add up to $500 in some cases. Before shelling out any money for a replacement, check your warranty, auto insurance, or roadside assistance coverage to see if they cover the cost of replacing lost or damaged keys. If your car is less than five years old, chances are you'll have to go directly to the dealership that has the expensive equipment required to program in the key fob. But if you have a car that's a little older, Consumer Reports says you can likely save some money by purchasing an aftermarket key fob. You can search online for the fobs based on the make and model of your car. We found a number of options on Amazon and Walmart, along with online auto parts stores for sometimes $200 less than the dealer. Many of these less advanced fobs can be laser cut and programmed by your local mechanic or locksmith. But if you're up for the challenge, programming it yourself can be a fun DIY project. You'll find all the instructions in the owner's manual. Just know that most customer programmable key fobs will require two current working keys in order to program the new one. If you do end up needing to get a new fob at the dealership, the good news is, is the process is pretty quick, typically taking just 15 to 30 minutes. For added convenience, a mobile locksmith can replace many fobs, programming and cutting the keys right in your driveway. And did you know that your key fob is hiding a little secret? So there is usually a mechanical key hiding right inside the key fob for your cars with the push button start systems so you can still unlock your door if that car battery or your fob battery runs out of that juice. Some cars have an obvious slot for all that stuff on behind the door handle. On others, a plastic cap hides the key right underneath. So just be careful, check your keys, make sure, mm -hmm. and usually it just slides right out. Ladies, mine has you. one. Yeah, mine does too. And Troy was so impressed <laughs> with that little well, yeah, magic trick. Thanks. Key, Thanks, Trooper Steve. He says it's Thank the valet you. key. Yeah.